most delightful party last night. I cannot tell you how handsome <laughs> is Captain Wentworth. He is so much more handsome and agreeable than anyone I have ever met before. Such manners, such conversation. Such capital. Oh, and we have all been invited to Kalinch tomorrow night for dinner. <laughs> Even you, Anne. Damn it, Mary, I'm late. Is he here? Oh, oh Captain Wentworth. Do, do, do come in. Forgive me, I... The door was open. I trust the boy does well. Oh, yes. Much better. Thank you, Wentworth. Oh, Captain Wentworth, this is my elder sister, Anne. We are acquainted. Really? But Anne has never said a word about it. It was a long time ago. You were away at school. Come, Wentworth. Well, the birds will all have gone south for the winter. Of course. Ladies. Henrietta, let us go with them. Oh, wait, 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 wait. The worst is over. I have seen him. We have been once more in the same room. A bow, a curtsy. I heard his voice. And then he was gone. He has not forgiven me. I have used him ill, deserted and disappointed him. And worse, shown a feebleness of character in doing so, which his own decided, confident temper could not endure. Once there were no two hearts so open, no feelings so in harmony. But now we are strangers. Worse than strangers. For we may never become acquainted. It is perpetual estrangement. And tonight, I am to be tested once more. <laughs> <laughs>